Hello and welcome to Open Book. Today we are going to talk about the wonders of the night sky and on what you can expect on stargazing this upcoming year 2021 astronomical calendar. This is the second part of the astronomical calendar series where this time we are going to cover from February all the way to December 2021. If you want to see the part 1 video, Click the link on the top right corner of this video for more info about it. Let's dive right in. February 8th will be the only meteor shower in February, up to 8 meteors per hour. In February 28th Mercury will reach its highest point in the morning sky in Capricornus. March 11th is where the windy planet will pass close to the sun and will be unobservable for weeks. On March 14th, the shower will peak close to the new moon, up to 6 meteors per hour. At March 20th, there will be equal day and night on Earth. The sun will shine directly over the equator. Also on it will be the first day of spring in the north and autumn in the south. March 28th will be the first supermoon of 2021. It'll appear bigger and brighter than average. And lastly, at March 29th there will be a great chance to see the planet in the evening sky. April 17th is where Mars will disappear behind the moon for the first time in 2021. April 22nd, it will produce its best displays before dawn, up to 18 meteors per hour. April 27th, the second supermoon of 2021. The April full moon is also called the pink moon. In the evening of May 6th, fireballs from Halley's Comet, up to 40 meteors per hour. On May 26, the total lunar eclipse will be visible from Oceania, the Americas, and Eastern and Southeast Asia also it will be the third supermoon of 2021, also known as the Flower Moon. And lastly at May 29, Venus and Mercury will pass near at each other. June 10th. The annular solar eclipse will be visible from Canada, US, Greenland, Europe and Russia. June 21st is where the sun will shine directly over the Tropic of Cancer. At June 24th it will be the fourth and final supermoon of 2021. On July 3rd Venus will pass very close to the beehive cluster of stars in the evening sky. July 6th the Earth will reach its most distant point from the Sun. In July 13, Venus will pass north of Mars. Look for the pair in the west at dusk. July 30th there will be up to 25 meteors per hour, best displays around midnight. On August 2nd, Saturn will make its closest approach to the Earth. It's the best time to see the planet. It will also rise at sunset and reach its highest point in the sky around midnight. Midnight at August 12th, one of the best annual meteor showers, the Perseids can produce up to 150 meteors per hour. August 19th, Mercury will pass south of Mars. In August 20th, Jupiter will make its closest approach to the Earth. In August 22nd, it will be the only blue moon of 2021. In September 1st, fireballs from Comet Keys, up to 6 meteors per hour. September 14th, Neptune will make its closest approach to the Earth. Also even at opposition, the planet will not be visible to the naked eye. In September 20th, the red planets will reach its most distant point from Earth. September 23rd is where the Sun will shine directly over the equator for the second time of this year. October 2nd, it will be the best time to see the Andromeda galaxy with naked eyes. In October 8th, Mars will pass close to the Sun and will be unobservable for weeks to come. Meteor shower also is peaking at up to 10 meteors per hour. October 21st, it will be one of the best meteor showers of the month, up to 15 meteors per hour. At November 5th, Uranus will make its closest approach to the Earth. Also the ice giant will not be visible to the naked eyes. In November 8th, 
the moon will pass in front of Venus, hiding the evening star for some time. November 12th is where the northern torrid meteor shower will peak on November 12th, up to 5 meteors per hour in November 17th. It will be visible a couple of hours after midnight, up to 15 meteors per hour. At November 19th, the partial lunar eclipse will be visible from Oceania, the Americas, Eastern Asia, Northern Europe and Indonesia. December 4th, the total solar eclipse will be visible over Antarctica, the South Atlantic Ocean and parts of South Africa. In December 7th, Venus will reach its peak brightness in 2021-2022 evening apparition. In the evening of December 14th, it will be the best meteor shower of the year, where it will be at its peak. December 16th, there will be up to 5 bright meteors per hour, flying at 65 kilometers per second. In December 19th, the moon will reach its full phase for the last time in 2021. And finally, for December 22nd, it will be the last meteor shower of the year, up to 10 meteors per hour. And that will be all for the astronomical calendar of 2021. Please consider subscribing by clicking the icon and don't forget to click notification bell for more updates. Thank you for watching this video, you can check the playlist for more open book videos, until then see you in the next video.